guys, Nick here. Just want to show you this uh, Mustang Turbo we rebuilt for uh, the 2.3. Uh, it comes with uh, reverse rotating uh, turbo. This is just the uh, super core, if you want to call it. And uh, so the, I'll show you the stock wheel versus the upgraded wheel. So this is the uh, the stock wheel. Then this is the upgraded version. So it's much bigger, about 10 mils big on the exducer. And then if you look at the uh, extended tips here, uh, camera's on this side. So you can see extended tips is this piece, how it extends, see how it extends wider? So this is the, the base and then it extends out just to get more, uh, more surface area. And uh, so you can see like this too. So yeah, I got a nice tall tip. So this uh, should flow about, I'm gonna guesstimate about a 35 wheel more. So just for compressor wheel upgrade, uh, it's a pretty good uh, pretty good upgrade. 35 wheel and then a longer power band and a bigger punch. Um, so yeah. Just show you comparison again. So we swap these out. You machine the housings. We could put a bigger wheel in there, but uh, I think this is uh, the biggest wheel that turbine uh, can support. This is a nice, uh, nice design turbine, so I don't feel like uh, we should be able to, we should have to equip these. It's a nice, it's a new design, nice wide open. Um, uh, we will eventually uh, port these two. Just waiting for a, uh, just waiting for a gasket to come in. And then we'll match the gasket to get some more flow and some better spool going on in there. So yeah, if ever you guys have a Mustang Turbo and needs a, a rebuild and uh, or just more power, if you want a little more pep uh, on stock fuel system, you don't plan on changing too much, this is the, the way to go. We just upgrade the compressor wheel and machine the housings and it's a drop in. So if you guys, uh, what guys are, can do is uh, this hot side can stay on the car. So this stays on the head. This stays on the downpipe, and if you're careful enough, you can heat the housing, remove the V-band clamp, remove, remove all your lines, heat the housing up, and then just slightly, gently remove the, the turbo of the half part, and then you can send that to us. And this will save you some time work and a less chance of stripped threads or broken bolts. Uh, that's only if you're up to the task. If you're, you know you're kind of rough with things, and just take it out in the hole. Cause you, we uh, we're gonna reuse the turbine wheel, so you don't can't have a damage, or else we're gonna charge you to replace it with a better, the new one. Um, so yeah, we have the CNC programs uh, all in house for the for these uh, high speed balance, low speed first, and the high speed. Um, yeah, everything's all uh, all uh, nice and CNC. I'll, I'll probably post pictures of it. Uh, the cover off so you can see inside how it's all polished off but uh yeah that's how she looks all right so uh, send us an email or give us a, a call or if you just want to send it in send the turbo in uh go to, uh, on our web page uh shipping instructions uh, and you gotta fill out the repair request form uh, fill it out with your info put it in the box and just send it in all right okay thanks